we just came out to head off. It's about 10.30 in the morning. We're gonna go drop that tax stuff off. I gotta pay my car insurance, mail a few things, and then we're heading about 45 minutes east. I'm gonna go pick up my aunt. I have her some soup and some German potato salad. Yesterday, Dad took my cousin Bart a container of soup and German potato salad. Uh, everything's, I have one tiny bit of German potato salad I'm gonna have tonight and um, we have a bowl of soup. I don't know if Dad's gonna keep it, eat it himself, or if he's gonna give it to the neighbor Bill. It's his decision, I told him whatever. Because uh, we had soup last night, it was very good. I even crunched chips up into it, it was good. I put everything in my soup last night. <laughs> a dollop of guac, or this and that, you know. But now we're gonna roll out, roll out. Buck, 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 buck. Yep, oh I even got a pretty cookie for my aunt. I think I showed it when I got him the other, this one the other day. But okay, we got errands to do. Dad's in running his um, tax stuff in, and we're gonna I mean, we're gonna take my aunt to the big Amish restaurant today, Essen House. Does Dutch bread Essen House? And so, and for the first time ever, I'm gonna order off the menu because usually my whole life we've either done family style or the buffet. And since I don't eat that much at one time, I just want to order off the menu. That way I can just take, bring my leftovers home to eat tonight for dinner. <laughs> Thinking about getting turkey, because turkey just sounds really good. Um, so yeah, that's what's happening. Boop, boop, doo. I'm outside of a big old building. It's been here for many years. It used to have uh, like ivy all over it, but they've cleaned it all off. But okay, you'll see us maybe next time when we're at the restaurant I gotta unlock myself so I can roll. Well, I'm taking a video, but we're in the restaurant waiting for them to call our name. But look at this little sloth purse. It is so cute. I love it, but I'm not spending that much money on it. They have all kinds of pretties. There's stuff up there, stuff down here. Over here's there's my Aunt Shelly and my dad. My Aunt Shelly just uh, pointed this one out. Oh my goodness. So cute. First course salad. Salad. Salads all around. They always come up really fine here. So, and Larry, I'm using your vouchers today. Here's my dinner. Turkey, stuffing, noodles, cranberry. This is gravy. I put it on the side. Dad got baked steak. Very good. Then my Aunt Shelly got smothered chicken with What's on it? Bacon Swiss and mushrooms and bacon. What's some? So now we're going to enjoy. We are home. Dinner tonight. Pow! Turkey stuffing noodles, a little bit of cranberry. This has got gravy in it. I had to put it on the side because sometimes I'm in the mood for gravy and sometimes I'm not. But I'll show you a few pictures that my aunt Shelly gave dad. These are of dad when he was young. I think you've all seen this one. This was his high school picture senior picture before he went into the navy then this is him whoops upside down him in the navy and then the other one is him and his brothers and sisters in the order of youngest to oldest so there's my aunt jenny my dad his brother joe becky and uncle chuck so then we're cool to see. Now I got someone crying down here because we just got home. She's like, where have you been? Oops. Not my desk. I got this card a few days ago and I put my finger through it, but I have not looked. I already know who it is by the handwriting. It's the storms. Oh, look at the Valentine's Day card. Enjoy the day, and most of all, be safe and happy. 2013 should be a good year for you. To Kitty, Stacy H., and Humper, just wanted to wish you a happy Valentine's Day from the storms. Thank you guys so very much. We had, our lunch was really good today for our Valentine's Day. In about two hours, Dad has to leave. He's gonna be calling bingo. Call a bingo. All right. But I'm going to take a chill with Kitty. 
I just got one printed out. Uh, that's all going to be tomorrow. But okay. Bye. Happy Wednesday. I refuse to put my little coat on today. It's like about 50. Windy, but I don't care. Uh, we're getting ready to rock and roll. I gotta call and make an appointment to get my oil changed. Every time I turn on my car, my man's like, oil change time. So yeah, lots of golfers out. It can't be fun golfing in such a windy day, but who knows? So we are off. He spotted me, don't. No, Bill, don't jump on the van. You know that's a no, 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 get down. No, Bill, no. How do you spot me so easy when I pull in the last couple times? Okay, yeah, go out there and see what's happening. Go patrol, go check things out. It is really windy out here. Okay, here comes Michelle, I gotta go. Sorry for the abrupt kind of ending. <laughs> Got a little hectic there for a minute. Now I'm outside of a roofing place. Dad's going in with Ron to use Dad's military discount for all the shingles we're buying for our new pole barn. Um, so that's happening. We picked up Ron at the shop. Then we gotta go take him back. But I'm gonna stop at Aldi and see if Ron will run in and just grab us a gallon of uh, milk just real fast. So we'll see. But all right, gotta go. This place is busy. There ain't much parking. People are coming in. It already looks like a hot mess. We picked up enchiladas at the Legion. That's the dinner today for eight dollars. This is enchiladas, a little lettuce and salsa, refried beans, and rice. There's Dad over there. He's got his all covered with stuff. Very good. Very good. That's dinner tonight. Is she down here? Hi, Kitty. What are you doing? Huh? I have shrimp up here, but you don't like shrimp. I know you don't. I don't. Maybe I'll find something that you can have. Hang on. And full of enchilada. I have some left for tomorrow. Dad ate all his. He doesn't like leftover Mexican type food. Let me wash it off there. Um, but I don't care. It says rice and beans and an enchilada. Uh, so I'll have that for lunch tomorrow. When, when we were outside, when I was outside waiting for Dad and Ron to come out of the roofing place, I had sent in our checkbook with my pen clipped to it, my desk pen. And uh, he comes out, and I'm like, you got the checkbook and pen? He's like, I got the checkbook, but I don't think I have the pen. I said, guess who's going back inside and getting my pen? <laughs> so he went and he goes, really? I'm like, yes, that is my good desk pen. So he went in, came right back out with my pen. Stacy was happy. You people who are particular about your pens, you understand. <laughs> uh, so yeah, I'll probably film some more tomorrow because I don't think I filmed a lot in the last couple days. But now I'm just done for the evening. She did not want all her treats. They're all... She leaves them like half chewed and gooey. Alright, bye. I'm getting ready. My glasses are falling off my face. Hang on. Oh, there we go. No kitty. Don't mess with it. I'm getting ready to have a piece of pie I bought yesterday at the Amish restaurant. Um, it's my favorite pie there. I usually get one every time I go, but the last several times I have not. But yesterday I'm like, I'm getting me a piece of pie to take home. So tonight, I'm going to have it. I'm going to turn you around. It's the red raspberry cream. So good. Hang on. Okay, it finally focused. It's like regular pie crust, and then it's like a custy cream, custard, it's like a custard, then a raspberry, red raspberry stuff, and then whipped cream. It is so flippity flopping good. And Kitty wants to smell the whipped cream so bad. Oh, oh you're going to eat it? Hang on, let me give you a piece off. Hang on. Just give me a minute. But okay, we're going to enjoy pie. It is Thursday. It is a rainy, crappy day. You guess what I'm making? I have noodles boiling. I'm getting ready to put together a tuna noodle casserole and steam my Brussels sprouts. I just put these out to get a little more room temperature because I got to get my steamer out. But first, I'm going to get my goop all put together before my noodles get done. Oh, I got to preheat my oven too. Okay, let's do that. There's my casserole. I grew up with no kind of topping on it. I saw people do 
crumbled up tater chips and breadcrumbs and cheese, but we we never did. My mom never did, so I don't. And then I got Brussels sprouts, and I found these in the cupboard. I opened dill pickle spears and sweet gherkins. So that's gonna be dinner. There I am. There's my dinner, and someone's still not here. It takes them forever. So I'll be back after dinner. Dinner was good. You know what we're gonna be eating tomorrow? Tuna noodle casserole. What are you What are you staring at me for? Ooh. And my sweet treat for tonight. I figured I'd show you what these look like. When Nikki and I went out, I got those freeze-dried caramel apple. Here it is. Freeze-dried caramel apple. And it's, listen. Can't eat it. They're really good. I like them. My mouth. Too, too full. Okay, it's gone. It's almost like a sweet tart. It's a sweet and a little tart. I like them. Very good. It's got about, I don't know, seven or eight slices left. I eat them one at a time so they last. Because that's how I roll. But I'm going to get all my clips from the last three days together. Get them uploaded tomorrow morning. So, goodbye.